Sea Neighborhood by Princess Ilke von Rothschild. Fifties. Here I am always thinking how make life the justice. A rap. And then came the eighties, a total knock off bifurcation. Either fifties or bitches. Back and forth, never get stuck. Who's gonna tell me what's the rock? There she is standing empty and voided. Her husband complaining. No Tokyo, no French Rivera. My wife is so lifeless. Totally ignoring her longing for intimate hints over her body. Not comprehending her fool of a husband who never gets that adventure. Rather than China begins in the hidden secrets of insight. To strangers in solitude blaming. The other, yes, it's the other, not me, who is boring. Day in, day out, she'd be doing the right thing, serving her husband, since he is the king. From cheerleader till church mouse, the silent drip, faucet not leaking, ah, one good teeny moment. An entire explosion broke her submission, finally to an end. Fifties to bitches, we don't give a damn. So what had changed around here? Nothing at all. Husbands banging a little louder on equal shorthand, while she sees nothing, nothing on end and nothing at all. Longing for closure, insatisfaction. Creep in. What you want from me, bitch? He claimed what she should have. Shut the fuck up now. I did pay the rent. Charles would have told me. He said it to J.D. They're not gonna like it. She telling their reality. They don't since, hey, when you pee in my alley, the bums get confused because they already mark their territory. Yep, laws change now from then to the now nows. Mega post, 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 post modern. No fifties, no bitches. Who let the dogs out?